Hello everyone, Drumat here in Diamond Tree against a, a brand perhaps. Although I had an Nautilus mid today and I inted my ass off not on mid lane but on jungle but still. So dude played Nautilus mid and that worked way, they might invade. So, uh, here we are in a game in Diamond Tree, we're going to do a level by level tutorial again because those are perhaps the most useful I'd say. Uh, yeah, brand support as we can see here, so it's going to be now Tilius Meat or Irelia Meat. Uh, I, I'm confused, although although that's a lot of ganks for gang setup for Kha'Zix if he is mid. We'll, we're going to notice soon. Well, first, at early levels, especially if the enemy is AFK as you see here, and if he's now Tilius, uh, you're supposed to actually push the lane because Against melees, you should you should put them into tower. Oh my fucking god, my mouse is weirding out. You should put them under tower so you can just do this. See? Just spam them, spam them, proc electrocute. There you go. Plus, farming under tower and under stress is extremely difficult for a lot of champions, especially when they are melee. And I'm just gonna do my spamming here. I hope. If I have a listen, he will not miss cues. And I found, I actually found. Please, 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 please. Okay, I'll take it. I. Did shut my mouth there because I really wanted to get that. Now the plus side of fighting an Nautilus is that you'll always have the push power. I'm gonna recall here. Obviously, I'm going to have advantage on lane and priority because he's playing Nautilus AP probably, and their jungler probably doesn't understand that he shouldn't really fight my jungler when I have priority. Also, I do not understand how a fights can kill someone actually. Look look at that. Tower shots on that. And instant gank by Kazik, instant exhaust, cool dodge. And we're basically we're basically winning this. Well, what? Okay. Okay, they, they literally turned around. Now Kazik at this point is hyper tilted, I'll tell you that. It doesn't take a genius to understand. So early, if you're against melee, what do we do? Again, we simply uh, push the lane. We try to keep on. We keep our heads up. Uh, we keep some advantage. I'm here actually hunting for that Kha'Zix because I expect to be here. I don't care if I die here, I actually manage my purpose, but... Okay. I'll take it, <laughs> I'll take the double kill. But... Sorry for the double kills. Yeah, uh, now Tilius might come... No, never mind, he's there. I actually did a lot of things there, and when I focus again, I cannot really talk. Because I'm really interested in... <laughs> Getting those sweet kills as I did there. I'm already 4-1. That's quite fast. I'll be honest with you uh, And if they kill him, that's amazing because they're going to have double off. I actually made their lane a bit harder But by not having brand there and he being level to that that should count I guess Plus I'm on the same farm as this dude Isn't that great? Now here I'm just gonna push because now till is recalled and I'm gonna use my minion the materializer on uh, on the melee. Now, if you are against a uh, melee, we push. If you are against a range champion, especially a squishy one, you have to keep it a bit uh, to the closer to the mid mid zone of the map. And early on, you can push against Katarinas, against I don't know Talons, but you have to be careful. And respect their damage, okay? You can push from far away. I've seen Kha'Zix. I don't give a fuck about uh, okay, language. 
See, this is this is quite obvious, buddy. And I'm gonna I'm gonna actually kill that Kazakh solo. Okay. We're actually winning very hard here. We're actually destroying them. <laughs> this is a very entertaining game actually. I haven't haven't been on fire like this since since I don't I don't even remember last time I played this good. Now you see what I'm doing here, right? I'm just I just try to be on the map for my team when I have the early advantage. I just try to go for the jungler if he failed up, I'll just try to tilt him even harder. I mean, like, yeah, you died. Okay, you'll die again. I'm, I'm gonna make sure of that. Now, there's a level 3 brand, and Irelia is getting very tilted herself, too. If I hit W here... If I hit W here, he's going to die. But... Now we have a... Uh, I'm gonna quick push this. You can also quick, quick push this by... <laughs> by doing that, by doing uh, minion dematerializer on uh, cannon, so you can recall and I'll tell you, the enemy will will wait a bit until he clears now. This is fucked. So Raka should run. Well, that that was very bad from our team. I, I did not understood why they did that. But I kinda hope Kinda hope that Kha'Zix will take the kill and not Lucian. Ah, uh, damn it. I'm not sure why Lee Sin is playing on the top side of the map because Tank will have a very hard time carrying. But at least, well, at least they are doing that. They are dealing a shit ton of damage there, so that is that. Now, two things now. One, going to check the Infernal, and two, going to check the Blue Buff. Because I'll take it. I'll tell you, I'll take it. I have a listen. And I'm fed to Leo. I'll take it. <laughs> well, I'm not going to push further away there, they knew. No. I do not expect a Kha'Zix nearby, but I do expect Lee Sin helping bot and helping me. There's absolutely no point now for Lee Sin to actually stay top so... Oh my god! Oh! What you can see here... It's a sneaky drake. A free sneaky drake. Hopefully. There you go. There you go. Now, I can die pretty easily to an Irelia gang. Okay, double kill. What? What did he do? Well, it's still fine, I suppose. But should have doubled there. Anyway, uh, Irelia just lost more there. Because now Tilly's killed me, everything went to shit for her. Now, if he dies here, yeah, that sucks. Uh, that wasn't necessary at all. <sighs> I hate the junglers that do that now. I can at least... I can at least go towards... Actually, oh my god, this is tilting. This is tilting. Yeah, I have a problem. I tilt a bit when my jungler fails randomly. Even though, oh yeah, that's pretty obvious. 
Even though I did not fail that hard, I mean, Irelia came, died. Listen, got the kill. What did you do here? How could you get caught? What division is this again, Diamond Tree? Doesn't feel like it. Doesn't feel like it. That brand feels like a free kill though. And this dude solos. Harold, Jesus. Well, at least it's the, the hope it's on that dude. I mean, there's literally our last hope. I'd love some attention from my jungler and there ADC is 5-0? What? Where is my jungler? Where is my jungler when I need him? Jesus, 5-0. Either a good Lucian. This is my vision work, by the way. And I expect the Kha'Zix to go bot any second now. Yeah. This went as bad as it could. He has the ult. He has the ult. Can you play on the right side of the map? Please. Yeah, he cannot. That's pretty clear. Now, the only thing that I have to do this game, supposedly, is kill Lucian and listen int again oh wait don't 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 back off And Kha'Zix got the full listen vibe, uh, well, gold. We have a fed mid and a fed top, we should win this. Now, this was supposed to be a level by level, but the amount of stress that this game causes because of the fails that the bot lane does, it's, it's, it's amazing. Please don't reset for the love of God, thank you. Next Drake, Alt of Malphite. Yeah, that's on the list. Just push, that's all I gotta do. Oh my God. Buddy, you're annoying. A little too much damage for my sins, for my my uh, feelings to handle. Oh my god! Oh. Yeah, I'm gonna die if I go there. Certainly that I'm gonna die. Did I win? I did not win. Did not lose either. And there might be a Kha'Zix, so I have to have the reflexes. Well, that's okay for me. I don't have. I didn't have bounty. Plus, the top lane is fun. You could 
literally turn on him now because he's alone. Although I suppose we don't have damage to kill him. Do we? Oh, please don't die. Thank you. Now, mid tower and bot. Mid tower and bot kill on Lucian. You have to focus on levels 5 to 10 on their prime targets, on their sweet, sweet prime targets such as Lucian. Because if you don't stop that Lucian, that Kogma, that whatever vein, he's just going to face roll you. Especially with proper defenses and so. Because I, I expect Irelia and Nautilus to try to die for her. Okay, I have a sneaky plan. Are we ready for the sneaky plan? I have no idea I'm here. So here we are on our sneaky plan. This is the sneaky Tlia. W, E, Q, whatever. Sneaky weight. This is the sneaky weight. Okay, I'm going. Okay, get it, get it. It's free real estate. Okay, we go for the next one, we go for the next one, because... What? He escaped? Holy shit. What? This is a good malfight. And we're going back to our sneaky sneaky spot. Sneaky sneaky. Kha'Zix is here probably, but sneaky sneaky. I have a very shitty farm. Okay. Hello! Mr. Nautilus, you're supposed to... Jesus Christ! Okay. Barrier. Bullet. I just, I just got one shot it for no reason. There. Is this in the bush? Is this misplaced here? my help. What is this? Okay, go. Okay, good. Excellent. Excellent. <laughs> uh, basically, the main thing that I do wrong in this game, and probably the only thing besides, I don't know, getting caught randomly. Okay, this is still good. Free kill. Um, I don't farm enough. Or I farm, but I don't farm properly. Kill him. My mind is telling me no. <laughs> but my body... Okay, no, basically... I should have a lot more farm. Now, I know there's a difference between Nissin and Kha'Zix, and he got a lot of farm from mid, but... I suppose I did fine, because I kept the game alive on bot lane. I mean, yeah, Lucian is 8-1, but that doesn't mean I actually fail with anything. Okay, that was just plain wrong, buddy. We're we gonna do this. There we go. Excellent teamwork here, guys. You really have just. Just zero 09. I've been zero 09, like, like that's because of other reasons that I'll take that free kill. Okay, Kazik's just stealthing around here, right? Buddy, stop. Oh my god. If he dies, it's fine. And that Malphite is actually scary at this point. I mean, what you really, you really can't do anything here with that Soraka silence. Especially, 
because it's 0-9, but yeah. Uh, but still, this is bad to Lia gameplay if you die that much, but if you die this much and your team wins every fight, then this might be decent to Lia gameplay, especially if Lucian dies. But um, you have to have more farm, okay? The first thing you need to practice is to Lia, level by level or not. You have to farm, you have to level by level farm, I'm gonna say that. So, focus on the farm, because that's what you need. Even though I'm having a lot of gold here, please be careful. Uh, I have this gold because I actually did some very aggressive plays early on, but Farming, on the other hand, if I had farm, I would have been very ahead, more, way more ahead than this. Now, here, here, here's this, this is the spot, okay? This is the spot. I'm gonna need you for this spot. Guys, you're not helping me with this spot. Are they doing a sneaky baron? Cadix and Urena are missing for quite some time. Okay, go for better. What am I supposed to do is go towards Baron and uh, hope that my tank actually defends me against Lucian because I'm the only one who can kill him. Oh, Kazakh is here. Okay, take it, 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 I tried. Do we need Zonia's this game? Uh, perhaps? Even though I'm supposed to just damage Lucian as much as I can and then die, I don't, I don't really care if I survive or not. Is this a legit build? What is this? What is this? At least he has like 70% creatures or something. Okay, let's siege. We have the tools, we have the means. Oh, free kill. Let's go. Oh, let's go here. Okay, I found Kazix. Well, actually, Kazakhs found me. If Lucian died, it's okay, it's over. They, they won without me, okay? Can even end because Lucian died. He holds 10 kills. Oops. Uh, I'm dead. Here, here is Zonia. Sonya should have been useful here, but Soraka is just Soraka, so... Yeah, basically we, we just did that and things are better now. <laughs> Lucian comes. I'm supposed to one-shot Lucian here. But it doesn't matter because we won. Okay, that was, that was intense. And Ooh, this is stressful guys. This is this is big stress for my life, okay? Because um, a lot of factors actually. One thing is that my bot lane died randomly all died there, it's very tilting. My Lissin died on mid game on mid lane, it's very tilting again because he should have not been there at all. 
and those things are uh, quite uh, how can I say uh, irritating but still still I believe if you work through them the games from if, from top to bottom if you do your best it, it's going to be fine so I really hope you enjoyed this game against no Tilius that's just weird to put it and see you next time actually no Tilius did very fine by the way see you next time guys goodbye